Hey, what's up, everybody? On my last uh, Top City of Tweaks video, people have been asking about the HTC weather clock that I had on the homepage. So this video is going to go over that. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is download Gridlock from Cydia. The, this will let you put your icons anywhere under the page, so you can put them down at the bottom so they don't get covered up by the the HTC weather clock. So after you download Gridlock, go to Cydia. Go down to search, type HTC, one second, HTC weather animated will pop up and you want that one, this one. And then yours will say install at the top right, mine says modify because I already have it, so install it. And then after it's done installing, find the icon, it will put an icon on your iPhone and it looks like this. So find that icon open it up and you'll get something like this. You probably won't have the gratified because that's I'm pretty sure that's part of a theme that I have downloaded but you want this one at the bottom HTC ANI PPH. Click on that and then here you can put it on any page you want. So you can put it on every home screen page you have if you want. I just put it on the first page so let me click page one and then click the home button and it will respring. Let's unlock and as you can see uh, there it is and you got the the Calgary will be the default city when you for uh, city when you first uh, put it on and it will be in Celsius and as you can see underneath these icons it shows the forecast so I might as well show you guys real quick how to change that so what you want to what you're gonna want to do is have iFile downloaded so go to iFile then go make sure you go all the way to the beginning so see how it says keyboard click that and it says library mobile far dash make sure you go all the way to the beginning it's just so you, it will be easier for you guys to know exactly where to go so I want you to the beginning go to far scroll down to mobile then click library scroll down to per, per page HTML right here click on that Click on HTC ANI PPH at the bottom. And here you go, you're going to want to find this configureme.js. So click on that. This is where you edit all your settings. So here, right here, um, it says zip code. That's where you're going to put your zip code. Uh, Celsius is set to true. So if you want it to say Fahrenheit, you'll make it say false. Uh, update interval is 180 minutes. I like to have it at 60. Uh, show forecast is set to true. So you can put that to false, and then it won't show the forecast underneath. Then down at the bottom, it's uh, show weather animated at false. So if you want the weather animations, you just set that to true. So let me do that for you guys real quick. <clears throat> so edit. Set the... Well, let me, turn, let me fix my focus for you guys real quick. Okay. So I'm going to set this Celsius to false so it shows Fahrenheit. Um, update interval, I want it to be 60 minutes. And then show forecast on off. It's all up to you guys. And then show weather animation, I'll set to true. So I like that. So click save, then done. Exit out. And then you're gonna want to do a respring, otherwise it won't show up. So respring your phone real quick. Oh, all right, here we go. Now let's unlock. And there you go. Change to Cincinnati, which is the zip code that I put in, and it shows the degrees in Fahrenheit, and it has gotten rid of the. Uh, show f the forecast and as you can see it's s partly cloudy so it's kind of got a sun showing up here in the corner so like I said the weather animations will show um, raindrops snow whatever it is and then so there you guys have it um, that's how you do the settings add it to your page so hope hope you guys like this video like subscribe and I'll keep providing videos if you have any questions just post them in the comments below all right thanks guys